Good evening guys from the lab. Today I ran into another interesting problem that I just want to quickly share with you and show you how to fix it. So I have a curved optic that has a radius of curvature of 0.1 meter and earlier I was facing this optic 45 degree relative to the incident beam and what happened was my beam becomes very elongated, very very elliptical. As you can see the cause of this problem is actually very simple. It is because the effective radius of curvature is equal to r the radius of curvature specified for this optic times cosine theta which is an angle of incident on the horizontal beam and the effective radius of curvature on the horizontal beam is r over cosine theta so our radius of curvature is 0.1 meter which makes our horizontal plane focal length equal to 0.47 meter and the vertical plane focal length equals 2.14 meter results in a very elliptical beam i forgot to mention that this optic was designed for a zero degree angle of incidence and because I want to measure a beam profile coming out of this guy to make sure that the waist is correct what I would have to do I can't measure a beam profile like this so what I would have to do is face it forward so that it is zero degree relative to the angle of incidence and just put a beam splitter here so that I have the reflected beam coming out this way and I can pick it off however I like here I just install a beam splitter. This is a waged uncoated beam splitter. That's why there's two beam coming out. But if you can find a better one, that would be nice. Unwaged maybe. And you can see that for the return beam, we have something coming out here, which we can measure a beam profile of. That's it for a quick tip today, guys. I hope that was useful. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe so that YouTube may someday pay me for my coffee and instant noodle. I'm smiling. You couldn't tell, can you? Anyway, thanks for watching guys. I'll see you next time.